This is Jose Ortiz from Caballero Republic in Washington, D.C., and this is Barber Tips. Today I want to talk about the importance of shampooing and conditioning your hair, answer some of the questions people may have about it. First off, let's start with shampooing. Some people think that you don't need to shampoo your hair every day or maybe once a week. Uh, they worry about drying the hair out or damaging the hair or they're just not aware of how often you really need to shampoo your hair. In my opinion, I feel like you can shampoo and condition your hair every day. You, you just have to properly do it. So today I will be explaining how to properly shampoo and condition your hair. When it comes to shampooing, you know, there's different types of shampoo. You have cleansing shampoos, you have moisturizing shampoos, you have two-in-one shampoos, which means it's a shampoo and conditioner in one. I'll talk about all of that today. Okay, so you want to start with shampooing. I suggest that you start that in the beginning of your shower. When you're first getting started, get your hair real wet, real good. Get your favorite uh, brand shampoo, whether it's a cleansing shampoo or a uh, moisturizing shampoo. Get about a quarter amount into the palm of your hand. Rub it in your hands real good. Get a good lather. Rub it all the way through your hair. Work through the scalp. Rub with the tips of your fingers and massage in a circular motion all the way through from the front all the way through the back of the, of the scalp. Once you work the whole scalp, you want to work it all the way through your hair, all the way out to the ends of your head. And build a good lather in, do it for about a good minute or two. Make sure you get all areas of the scalp, get all trouble areas you may have in your scalp that you had build up from hair products or dirt, you know, get rid of bacteria all those negative things that you have in your scalp that could cause uh, problems later on. So what's happening when you're shampooing is you're cleansing the scalp, you're cleansing the scalp, you're cleansing the hair, it's stripping everything out from each hair follicle, dirt, bacteria, hair products, all negative buildup that you have in your scalp. It's stripping all of those things, it's getting rid of all the negative scalp buildup, then you have to follow up with conditioning. That's why it's important to condition after you shampoo. So after you're done shampooing, you're done massaging your scalp, cleansing your whole hair, head of hair, um, you wanna rinse it out with water and make sure you use warm water because the warm water opens up your pores and your hair follicles and then um, it gets, it makes sure all the dirt and bacteria gets out there. So once it's all rinsed out, you got all the shampoo out with warm water. You want to follow up with a conditioner. Typically, whatever brand shampoo you use, you want to use the same brand conditioner. Some conditioners are more intense than others. It all depends on the condition of your scalp and your hair. For example, when you take a shower and you cleanse yourself, some people come out and they apply lotion to their skin because they may feel like their skin is dry. This is the same thing you're doing with your hair and your scalp. You shampoo, it strips everything, it dries your hair out, so you wanna replenish the moisture back into your scalp and your hair, so you have to use conditioner. So every time that you shampoo, you wanna use conditioner. And so when you're conditioning, put the same amount of conditioner in, your, in the palm of your hands, about a quarter size. Rub your hands together, work it all the way through your scalp, through your hair, from the root of your hair all the way up to the tip of your hair, all the way through. Then you wanna let the conditioner sit. In my recommendation, for about three to five minutes, let it sit, let it absorb into your pores and into your hair follicles. So when you do the shampooing and conditioning in the beginning of your shower, you knock that out, cleanse the rest of your body. By the time you finish cleansing and rinsing off the rest of your body, three to five minutes should have passed. And that's enough time for the conditioner to sit in your scalp and in your hair to, to replenish all the moisture that's needed and um, give you a, a nice, soft, um, healthy look to your hair. Once you're done with the conditioner, you want to rinse it out with cold water. It's important that you use cold water because the cold water 
closes your pores back up, it shrinks it, and it, sh it closes your hair follicles back up. The warm water opens your pores and opens the hair shaft to get rid of the dirt. The cold water closes the pores and closes your hair shafts in order to trap the moisture from the conditioner into your, into your scalp and into your hair follicles. So I mentioned a two-in-one shampoo and what that is, is it's both cleansing with the shampoo part and moisturizing with the conditioning part. And a lot of uh, male products are using two-in-ones for convenience. In my opinion, uh, I don't suggest to my clients to use a two-in-one because it's kind of, they both doing the opposite. Shampoo is for cleansing and stripping conditioning is for uh, adding moisture back so how I don't feel like you're gonna get the same impact from each one when they're both combined into one product so in my suggestion I would stay away from two-on-one shampoos I would recommend to use uh, separate the shampoo by itself and a conditioner by itself and what's so important about shampooing and conditioning your hair it helps with the health of your scalp and your hair itself. If you want some desired looks, if you want to clean, you want your hair to be soft and manageable, you should shampoo and condition your hair, I would say at least three times a week. Just like you wash your hands and the rest of your body every day, you can as well wash your hair every day and condition. You just have to take the proper steps like I explained earlier in the video and you'll be fine. Again, this is Jose Ortiz from Caballero Republic. I hope all the information I gave you was useful for you. This is Barber Tips.